need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. The project allows you to create visual reports that compile data from your project and then display the results in a visual report within another application such as Microsoft Excel or Visio. Note that to use visual report templates you must have either or both Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Visio installed in conjunction with Microsoft Project on the same machine. If you do, then you can create visual reports within Microsoft Project. If using Microsoft Project 2013, click the Visual Reports button within the Export button group on the Report tab within the ribbon. If you're using Microsoft Project 2010, click the Visual Reports button within the Reports button group on the Project tab within the ribbon. At this point, in all versions of Project, the Visual Reports dialog box will appear. Note that you must have the Microsoft Excel and or Microsoft Visio checkboxes checked at the top of this dialog box to show templates from Excel and Visio within the dialog box. You can then see any available reports displayed within the tabs in this dialog box. Each tab represents a category of visual reports. You can click the various tabs shown to switch the reports displayed. To view a report, click on the name of the visual report to display within the desired tab. Then select the Select Level of Usage Data to Include in the Report drop-down to select the level of detailed data to display. The default choice is Weeks, but you can also select a different time increment from this drop-down. After making your choice, click the View button at the bottom of this dialog box. The report will then display in a separate application window using either Excel or Visio, depending upon the type of report that you selected. You can then print the report within the selected application as needed. Now when you're finished viewing the report, you can choose to use the Save As command to save a copy if you wish. You can then exit the application to close it and return to project. You can click the Close button within the Visual Reports dialog box to close it when you're finished generating visual reports. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www dot teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.